Hi everyone, I'm Sarah Kajumko with your political roundup for Tuesday, January 11th. Arizona Congresswoman Gabrielle Giffords is said to be breathing on her own and remains in critical condition. Doctors say they will have to take it day by day with Giffords and as long as she doesn't backslide, no news is good news for the time being. Giffords was shot in the head this past weekend at a constituent open house. Six others died in the shooting. Heading to our nation's capital, a panel set up to oversee the Gulf of Mexico oil spill says it could happen again if the government does not take some drastic steps. The group concluded that more research, money and regulations are needed to prevent a future disaster. These findings are included in the report called Deep Water, the Gulf Oil Disaster and the Future of Offshore Drilling. In Texas, a judge sentenced former House Majority Leader Tom DeLay to three years of prison for conspiracy. DeLay will also serve 10 years community service for money laundering charges. In November, he was charged with funneling almost $200,000 to help elect Republicans back in 2002. And a top Islamic leader says the Pope should mind his own business. This after Pope Benedict XVI called on Pakistan to repeal its anti-blasphemy laws, saying they are a pretext for acts of injustice and violence against religious minorities. And that's your political roundup for Tuesday, January 11th. I'm Sarah Kajumko. Check back with RTTNews.com all day for the latest political headlines.